Fans from all over flocked to the Big Easy for the NBA All-Star Basketball game. Local 15's Clement Townsend caught up with a few fans from our area who traveled there. New Orleans hosted the All-Star game for the second time in the history of the city, and it was a success. More than 50,000 people were expected to come to town, and several Mobile folks came to soak in the atmosphere. For me, once a lifetime opportunity. You know, I'm a big sports fan, I'm a college football guy, but have the opportunity to drive over here to New Orleans for Mobile, you know, and get in that game and just see all the stars in one in one place for a showcase. That's what it's all about. It was nice, you know, only a two hour drive. We got a chance to come down here and have fun, walk around and enjoy the sights. How did you all land tickets? Man, a friend of mine called me last night. We were actually in Faro eating dinner and he called me and said, Hey, I got some extra tickets, y'all wanna go? I called Cole up and I said, hey man, we got to go to New Orleans tomorrow. So we headed this it way. A must, it's a must do. Yeah. No brainer. It's a no brainer. Let's go. We'll take it. Let's go. Right You're going to have to repay that friend pretty uh, big time. He already told me, he said, don't forget about when Iron Bowl rolls around. <laughs> Last night, bourbon was crazy. But in general, it seemed like everybody's having a great time. Uh, all the waiters, waitresses, service people have been very, very nice, very, very willing to help on anything. And New Orleans just opens up when they have festivals. So I, will, I would always recommend it. Several public figures on hand to check out the All-Star Game. The expected economic impact for New Orleans is $90 million. Covering the All-Star Game, Clement Townsend, Local 15 News.